When you're connecting the communication cable between the Sangro SBR battery and the inverter, one of the most important things is to get the correct connection. Now, you see here on this RJ45 plug, uh, some of the older ones were molded, the newer ones you actually make the plug up yourself. It has to be locked into position and there's two reasons for this. One is if you look inside you'll see this rubber membrane inside. When you lock the plug in it gives it the proper IP rating seal. The other one is for the connection. You'll see the, the, little, the normal clip that connects an RJ45 is actually in enclosed in the plug so make to make sure that it's the correct connection this lock nut has to be actually locked now i'll show you how to do that on an actual battery attach the cable making sure you plug the rj45 in the correct way push it down a little bit hand tight with your hand and with the tool provided slip it over the cable like that down there and tighten until you feel the lock. You will actually feel it locking in place. Then remove the tool and that is it properly connected. When you're connecting at the inverter end uh, there is included a multi little plug and it's uh, spring loaded connectors. You must terminate the cable, don't twist the wires, terminate the cable using the supplied bootlace ferrules, they are the correct size and the pins are the correct length. They do need to be longer than the standard so please use the ones that are in the box and you simply just push these into the spring loaded terminal like so and that is a good connection.